What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another Super Dragon Ball Heroes World Mission video. My name is D-Free. Here today, we will be playing the tournament mode. So apparently, there's a tournament mode in the Hero Stadium. So make sure you guys are playing it. You do get rewards and all that stuff. So we're going to be playing this. And I want to show off a really cool combo that I figured out. It's not anything special, but something I really enjoy doing. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into today's video. So first thing I want to ask is like, do you guys enjoy this video layout more than the last one that I've been using for my previous videos? Let me know in the comments down below. If you want me to switch back, whatever the case is, make some edits to this, I'll be more than willing to go ahead and do that. So this deck's a little bit different. So if you're wondering like what we're trying to do, long story short, we really want to capitalize on this Vegeta. His ultimate unit attack here, Universe 7 Ultimate Warrior unit. So this one allows him to do a three card combo with any adult Gohan card and with any Goku card as well. They Well, as long as they're adult Gohan and it's Goku. So it can't be like Zeno Goku or whatever the case is. So that's what we're trying to do today. So we're gonna pull that off and try to have fun. So let's go ahead and jump in into our first fight of the video. Bro, we are really up against a full Frieza squad. Really? For real? Look at that. Goresh is somewhere crying in happiness, man. All right, so the way that this one plays is Krillin is basically a perma support. The same thing goes for uh, Gohanks as well. They stay in the back row to offer different things. So we're gonna go ahead and put the Gohanks back. We'll put Krillin back. Uh, for now, though, I do want to say that I do need to leave Mass uh, King up here. Well, he can be anywhere, but he needs to be an attacker. And we also want to let the Vegeta be an attacker. And we will, as far as Goku, he's kind of like, wait, which which one am I doing, right? Uh, we're going to let Goku actually come up and be an attacker as well. The enemy chose back row, basically attacking. So we'll see how this one goes. We have a ton of different things kicking in here. So will we win the power level? We do actually win the power level clash. All right, so first CI. I've been practicing trying to get a little better. Uh, working on trying to click it before it gets to perfect. So, like, the, any delay. You know, somebody left a comment about that. And it's actually been very helpful. So, thank you if you're listening. All right. First attack phase. All right. So, we're up against the Cooler and Frieza. First form, we have Dark Mask King. And, oh, perfect. Ooh. All right. So, we already have a ton of hero energy. So, that means we already have our super attacks eligible here. So really what I'm going to have to do is maybe sabotage ourselves a little bit uh, next round. Depending on how much we do here, I might actually have to sabotage the rest of this turn, to be honest, which is hilarious. <laughs> yeah, I've got to already. We're doing way too much damage. Initially, I had the Dai Shinkan on my team actually as well, uh, but it was just it was too much damage. I couldn't actually make it to like where I was able to do what I wanted to do. I guess it does. Oh, we lost that. I wasn't even trying to. Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter as long as I get the ultimate unit. But, like, regardless, I want him to transform the Goku and all that stuff. And it's it's high, heavily, like, stipulated. So, again, you can use any Goku. You can use Ultra Instinct. You can do whatever you want. I'm actually go low on this one. I don't know if I would have won that anyway. But we do go ahead and lose that attack. Uh, as long as I don't get stunned, though, I'm fine. But regardless, I do have an equipment to help mitigate that. Look at them dabbing. Look at them dabbing. All right, we go low again. Look at them dabbing on me. All right, hold on. So we took a nice amount of damage there. We should be uh, basically, oh, I tried to lose that. Thanks, Miracle. <laughs> we should be basically at a point where we are maxed out on hero energy as well. To where we can do whatever we want. So, stole one hero energy. Okay, we are literally just about maxed out. Sure, Krillin, we'll go for your battle capsule. I'll actually use it against the enemy because I don't want to do any more damage. <laughs> uh, I, I don't want to I don't want to do anything. Wait, no, this is just power level one, I think, right? Regardless, can we get three? Charge at Krillin! Go! 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 Woo! <laughs> we got three. It's so uncommon for me to actually get three. All right. Throw them in good spots, my boy. Capsules commence! Support area, support area, support area. Ah, uh, all three of the attack areas. Okay. All right. So uh, that equipment allows for the attackers to just keep going regardless of uh, how low they are. Are you going to go third form on me? Are you going to go Xenomorph? Or Xenomorph? You are. Oof. Look at that dig in. Look at that little head. All right. So, eight, oh, wow. 8,000 to 1,000. So, we we clearly won the power level there. No debate. That Vegeta Blue, uh, that's the attacker right now, the Resurrection FG one, he's really good for uh, hero energy. Not hero energy, but uh, for power level. I'm going to have to make an edit to this team because I have to be at max. And the minus hero energy keeps ruining it because Vegeta requires max. 
So let me actually make a cut, and we'll be right back, everyone. Okay, so I have went ahead and made numerous changes, in fact. Not really, but I did go ahead and add in Golden Cooler as another attacker. He's actually really, really good, by the way. Very consistent unit, and uh, other than that, uh, I think that's about it. I changed out the Gohans because this one I, I like a little bit more anyway, but same general premise. So we are going to jump in and see if we can get that early dub. So let me actually go ahead and uh, put this one in. Go. Thank you. So what I will do is put you in the front. Well, on this attack row anyway. You can go up there too. You are support by nature. <laughs> You're support too. And then top row for cooler. All right. So we do actually win round one's power level check. Well, again, we do want to do some damage here. And afterwards, we'll see what we can do. It's it's a little... The, the issue there was, uh, if I'm understanding it properly anyway, is that since I was having my uh, hero energy reduced below 10, which it requires, it was basically negating that ability. So we're already at 10, by the way. This is really cool. <laughs> we're already at 10. Um, that's awesome. <laughs> this is such a good hero energy team. All right, so... Cancel the enemy's guard. We're going to fly in. And let's see. All right. I lost that one. Not a big deal. I mean, we did a little bit of damage, which is all I really, really need. I just got to make sure we defend. So I'm going to actually make sure I'm looking at the TV screen here as opposed to the computer screen because there's a slight delay. I said that in just about every video. All right. So let me make sure. Oh, that one was good. That one was good. Okay. Not perfect like I wanted, but it's good. We are able to defend. So going into next round, we are already at 10 actually here. Wait, I thought I changed the Gokus out. We got a perfect. I thought I changed the Gokus out. I meant to actually add in a UI Goku, but I guess I didn't. Regardless, not a big deal. Okay, well, Dark Mask King. Ooh, win again. Three in a row. Nice. All right, so that should be all the defense. Reduce stamina. Stole one hero energy. Minus two to me. I'm back at max, so this should trigger... There it is. Okay. So, ultimate unit. Uh, now I can do what I want. Now I do what I want. Woo! Okay, like I said, the issue was that my hero energy was dipping. And it really made a big difference. So, we're going to go with this. I meant to add in a UI Goku because I planned on using this ability round two instead of round three. Uh, and there's a UI Goku SEC, a secret from UVM1. I think that's really good. Regardless, um, we're going to go all the way in. Whatever. Screw it. I don't care. We're going to try to go for game. Try to go for game here. Round two. All right. He's transforming yet again. We've already seen it happen. All right. At least it's pretty quick when it comes from the enemy. Uh, when it's me, I have to wait a whole 10 seconds, right? All right. So lock on. Uh, we're going to lock on. I guess it doesn't really matter. We're going to go with uh, you and Goku, please. Oh, I was going to say, let me, let me use the Goku. All right. Double lock. Two doubles. All right. So now that we've done that, I just got to make sure we win the CI. And we might go for game here. This might be game. Um, okay. Yeah, like I said, I did have to make some tweaks. Okay. So I just had to make sure that I started with uh, 10 energy. With them reducing my energy, it screwed me, as I thought. Okay. Because this one is a really expensive attack. S unit attack is ready. All right. It doesn't require CI. Watch this. This is really cool. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> this should be game, actually. This should be game. Yep, it's game. It does a lot of damage. 50. I could have made it do a lot more than that, actually. But that's really cool, man. A round two victory. <laughs> so... It just took a little bit of time, a little bit of edit, but uh, we figured out the proper strategy for that. And like I said, you can use whatever Goku you really want. Really, I, I meant to put in that SCC UI Goku. So we're going to play one more match and try to do the exact same thing again, but I will actually swap out that Goku, and we'll be right back, everyone. So this time we're going full power-up mode. I went ahead and made a couple more edits. So this time around, we have the Dai Shinkan. He is really good because of this ability here. You can only have one SP card per deck, but when you deploy his ability, he gives plus 30,000 power to all attackers on your team. Busted. 
All right, so let's go ahead and proceed. This time, again, we did make some changes. I do have the Daishinkan and Daishinkan, Daishinkan, and uh, we also do have the UI Goku. So we don't need to do much this round. This round, I just need to accumulate hero energy, and then round two, same concept. We are going to jump in with that extra, extra thing, extra hype. Father, son, Kamehameha into Gambit Burst Flash. Into what was that star? Like a moon? Th not the moon, obviously. The sun? <laughs> I don't know. Anyways. All right. Uh, we do lose this, which I don't really mind. That's actually not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing to lose. All right. So, at least not right now. We got the perfect there, which will turn into three supers. I probably shouldn't have, I probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> this is probably bad. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Are you guys serious? Don't solo this. Don't do it. Goku, please. Gohan's not going to do much. Goku, please. This is not you guys. You're not supposed to beat it now. Please. You're supposed to beat it later. <laughs> One more turn. Okay, thank you. All right. Wait, no, no, no. Hold on. I think there's more. Oh, come on. I knew there would be more. I didn't even use the Daishinkan. Okay, we win the power level, of course, as you would expect. Increases my hero energy. We should be at a point where we're launching all supers here. Because Dark Mask King is pretty broken for that. We should be launching a ton of supers. All supers, yep, I thought so. We might win this round, like I said. Yes, got it. I was like, oh, I don't think it's it. All right, so we're going to launch a couple of attacks there, but I really need to get him with the UI Goku one. Next round, or like the next CI is the one I really need to get. We're going to almost beat them here, though. Yeah. Um, Daishinkan increases damage by a lot. By a lot. This might almost get them. Yeah, okay. That's a lot. Okay. For round one, by the way. Okay. Yes! Okay. Let's see how much this one does, because they're all going to super attack. Everybody else is going to super here. This is going to be nice. Okay. This is going to be nice. All right, UI. All right, we're going to get the explosive energy cutter from Gohanks. Not bad. All right. The final flash, by the way. Not bad. And we're going to come through with Gohan's just something, I guess. His little uh, Z-Sword slash. That's so generic. Incredibly generic attack, Gohan. You literally do nothing. But this one, this is the be gone thought. This is it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see how much we did. How much did we do? That's payback! <laughs> That's payback for ruining my strategy earlier. I got full payback. Screw you. Okay, so we're taking on our final opponent of the video, by the way. We're going to put the Dai Shinkan down because it's a little bit too early to be using that, man. We got to put you back. And then other than that, we are basically all good here. So we're going to allow Vegeta to go up. And last but not least, Gohan can go max row too. All right, so... They're getting a lot of hero energy, apparently. Kind of the same concept, because my super attacks are basically ready already. <laughs> I um, Well, Dark Mask King isn't getting one, but there are numerous. So I need to make sure that we don't win here. I just need to make it to round two. And assuming there's no stupid hero energy manipulation at the end, I should be fine. I'll have to find better counters to that type of ability. No, stop! Why? I didn't want that. I did not want the miracle. Ooh, dab on Vegeta. Okay, please. Vegeta, please don't do too much. Oh, UI is supering. <laughs> uh. Please? Thank you, please. Thank you. <laughs> I just need one more turn. Why is that guy sabotaging? He's actually, I was very impressed by him at first. But he's really good for the first couple of turns, man. He's really good the first couple of turns. All right. Um, uh, thank you. All right. I didn't mind that. I just, oh, wait, no, it's not even an attack turn, so it didn't really matter. All right. All right. Perfect. I can do it. Yes. We will be doing it this round. All right. Gohan, I don't, I don't really need your ultimate unit chance, Gohan. Sorry. Uh, I'm not using you as my leader. Vegeta, be careful if you do my strategy, because if you use Gohan, he'll use up two hero energy, I believe. So Goku, yo, let's do it. Ah, okay, there we go. 
All right, and everybody's going forward. We're doing it. We're doing it. Let's go. All right, Daishinkan will activate as well. This should be nice. This should be a nice finisher. I'm excited we were able to pull this off. All right, and I don't even need the charge impact. This is going to be a KO for sure. There's like no way. Enemy is transforming. They always apparently need to transform. Doesn't really matter. You're about to take that L, my boy. All right, so we got this transformation kicking in. All right, I'm excited, man. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm also very excited for the damage. I'm excited for the damage. All right, let's see what they do. Because UI has his own damage bonus. Uh, we did trigger the uh, Daishinkan. We've got the ultimate unit kicking in. Yo. All right. Kick it in. All right, the beat drop too, by the way. All right. Let me turn it up. Oh, boy. <laughs> Look at that ugly Zarbon. He's so ugly. Oh, my gosh. All right. Oh my gosh. Yo, okay. Well, that is our conclusion. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hit that subscribe if you are new for more content. Make sure you leave a thumbs up. Show the support for the Dragon Ball Heroes content. I've been experimenting and really having a lot of fun with this game. It's really fun. So thank you all, and I'll catch all of you guys in the next one.